little sweetie nanny hair. Mm -hmm. Anyways, yeah, so um, today I am actually going to help out the F1 slash international students that have been like going school abroad. So basically, you guys know that when you're an F1 student or yeah, international student, whatever you call it, however you want to call it, basically, mwah, um, I love you guys. I love you guys so much because like you are so awesome, and like I love the I love your culture. But anyways, moving along. Um, yeah. So basically, when you're an F1 student, it all starts off with um exams some exams not necessarily only for f1 students it can be for students that are from from the country too but like i'm just trying to help out the f1 students here um the first exam you get you need like you need to get is to enter college is a tsa exam yeah so that exam is based on math and english grammar vocabulary summaries and different stuff like that so yeah it's just like a broad stuff like what you know so they could place you in a level that is suitable for you and then you enter your classes but you don't enter your classes in like one time it starts off with what you call basic stuff to prove yourself so i'm just going to show you guys some stuff you can get when you actually enter school and stuff like that so like it's going to be a little easier on you guys because i know it's been a little hard on you guys lately especially for the registration and stuff like that and examinations and stuff like that um by the way examinations it takes like three to five hours depending on your speed and it's like a self a self time thing so they don't rush you to do anything it's all based on your your pace so don't think like oh my gosh i am going to die and it's so much work you just gotta take your time i know it might kind of is stressful but just relax and read for everything don't make the mistake of passing everything and just answering things because you're tired it's not a good idea at all but anyways so i am going to show you guys some of the stuff you can get when you actually enter college and you start in your class so yeah first off uh pens I got this um, G2 pens. I like them because like they erase. It's easy, easy to erase and stuff like that. Is that bad to run? Yeah. You can erase your work and stuff with it. Yeah, so that's why I like it. And the point is like amazing. So it's just so easy to write with. Um... I got two of them. Yeah, two of them. Um, one of the most important things you need to get is a planner. Uh, just basic, just basic stuff. Monthly, weekly. I go with a weekly planner, so I it's easy for me to like plan my stuff by the day. Um, of course a pencil case but i got a crazy pencil case i actually got a pencil case with a locker so no one can like enter this i got this from walmart it is just i think it's it's just like mm, like free 3.99 not expensive oh and i also got a journal my little, little book um i can like write stuff in it well you can just write stuff in it basically because it's more for f1 students i'm trying to help out here um and most importantly a calculator if you like failed exams and like math and stuff you are going to enter class regardless so you need a calculator i got this one okay it it has 
um, different cosine and tangent, whatever they call it. I don't know, like, oh, I don't like math. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry with the math. I'm sorry about the math. But yeah, I got these cute notebooks. Um, when getting notebooks, I like to look at the back when it, when it shows college. It's really good to like look in the back for college and stuff, so it's easier for you to find the right books. I didn't get those with the binders and stuff because like it's too big and ugly. Like oh, who wants this? Um, this probably would be good for guys. So like I have like two to three classes in one day. So yeah, these things are cute. I got this one and this one. And this one so yeah i'm so creative <laughs> but yeah i got simple pencils not expensive it's just 197 um uh, and i got all these things at walmart so you can imagine um a lot of nursing students actually do with hauls i think that's the name but i'm not really interested in that i don't think about the brand i think about the quality and the consistency and how long it lasts i am watching price i am watching nothing if it's good it's good i take it how it is you get something good you don't look at the price i'm sorry it's just on my that's just on my part i ain't criticizing anyone um i got this for my wall so like i can put different stuff to remember if i want to like write the subjects i am going to do for the day when i get home and stuff i need to study you just write it on there and there's like this little thing over here that's just like it's it's um I'm not sure <laughs> but it's in that range um most importantly you really need like this and this is what you call Highlight holes. You need highlighters to highlight your work. Basically, you need it. It's a necessity. 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 <laughs> yeah, guys. I'm actually getting over with everything right now. Um, the binders. You guys need the binders. Like, you get these things. You put like your file sheet, your blank paper. It's gonna be important. I'm telling you, I got two. So that's how important I find it would be for me. Yeah, and they're cute. They're really cute. I got these for like for some. Not expensive either. Um, I have no idea why I got this. Well, that's for my nursing glasses. I do nursing glasses. But like F1 students like we don't really need this. Just don't need this, but if in case you can always get one of these and just put it in and act like a nurse. Yeah, get in the get in the spirit like mm, oh my gosh, how many dosage? <laughs> I'm so weird. <laughs> I know but yeah. So yeah guys, that's like basically it. Oh, I got these bags. I got this small little bag. I'm not really going to use this bag much. I'm not going to use this one. I got this at, um, what do you call this place? I honestly forgot the name of the place I went to. Oh my gosh. I forgot the name. But I'm going to link it down below. Okay, guys. Um, yeah, I got this night bag because it actually has it actually has like the the laptop holder. So like when I actually put my laptop and tablet and stuff in there, it won't just hang out and go everywhere. Like, oh here, I'm going out. And like, it's not gonna be that difficult for you to like get out and get in and stuff like that. So yeah, guys, it's basically that's basically. Oh wait, I'm missing something. I'm missing something. I have a strong feeling I'm missing some. I think I buried it. <laughs> I literally think I buried it. I buried that. 
Okay, what is this? Hmm. Um. I don't know. Oh, I see it. I'm sorry. Oh, my back. My back stuff is like filled. I I put this thing for like. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I put this thing on the ground for me for like like a little softness because like my my chair is like literally hard but yeah i got these things they're really important and will help you with studying especially if you have like a textbook and stuff and you don't understand some of the work that is given you just write this some powerpoints and stuff like that or like if you're reading some and you just jot down something yeah, just drop something down like boom. But yeah. <laughs> um yeah, so that's basically that's what I was looking for basically. Um yeah, that's just about it. So I hope I help you guys a little in what you need to get. Um but like for the TSA and stuff like that don't don't panic about that because like it's really just testing you on what you're supposed to know and stuff like that you don't really need to study but i encourage you to study and i encourage you to read everything every damn thing you need to read it because like if you're tired just sleep sleep for like 30 minutes and get up and continue to work because it it, it will be worth it um so yeah guys you guys gonna see me in the next video Love you guys. Later. Peace. Hope.